NJ Cody Ironworks, let's talk about drill bits and sharpening drill bits. You want to save yourself a lot of money, learn how to sharpen a drill bit. Um, the head on most of these drill bits, especially ones steel and plastic and stuff like that, they have a 120 degree angle. I've got this really cool little gauge that will show you how the angle, when you, if you've got your angle right on your drill bit, but if you don't have that gauge, the head on the nut is also 120 degrees, so you can just compare it. You also want to see that the edge on this edge of this drill bit, the back is just a little lower than the front, but not a ton. Well, not everybody's got one of these. You can use a actually use sandpaper if you're good on a on something flat if you have to. But uh, we're going to do it this way. We're just going to clean up the edge of this. Now you can see that I'm a little too far back there, so I'm going to lower my blade a little bit, lower the bit a little bit. We're getting there, see? Now this is an old rusty one. You can mark this with a Sharpie. And of course, it's easy on a big drill bit to show you. That's why I'm using this big old rusty one. Okay, so we're right about there now. But in order for this to cut right, you have to take this back edge off. Or else they don't cut worth a darn. A lot of times I'll do a little radius like that you got to try to keep your the point of your drill bit in the center if you um, get it offset a little bit it'll make your hole bigger which sometimes is handy if you just need a hole just a little bit bigger let's try it Get it hot and hit it. Always wear your safety squints. Oh, and whatever you do, don't overheat your uh, drill bit, or else you'll burn it up and you'll take all the temper out of it, and then it won't hold an edge worth a darn. Hence the reason I'm using this very slow hand crank grinder.